everybody. This is Spot. Spot, this is everybody. We're going to take a look at Spot, an incredible piece of technology that's been designed by Boston Dynamics. See, last year, Hyundai bought Boston Dynamics, or they bought a massive share of it. And you might be wondering why a car manufacturer wants anything to do with robotics. Well, car manufacturers now spend a lot of time talking about mobility, and this thing is pretty mobile. Now, mobility can mean small personal transport, or it could mean an exoskeleton that helps a person with a disability to be more mobile than they would previously have been. Yeah, it can even do stuff in theory in the future, like going down mine shafts to rescue stuck miners, or going to disaster zones or nuclear zones and that sort of thing to do what it needs to do, or even just survey. He's got five cameras. He can see in infrared. He can see in 360 degrees. He can operate at minus 20 degrees Celsius. He can carry 14 kilograms. He can run at almost six kilometers an hour. And he can do this. We're gonna test a couple of things, including his ability to climb stairs and find his own way past obstacles. Up he goes which is pretty impressive, I reckon. He uses his cameras and his LiDAR sensors to detect obstacles in front of him. So I'm just gonna to touch on the screen. He's gonna make his own way through. How cool is that? There's a lot of technology that translates into the car. So you've got things like the camera system. Spot's got five cameras that provide a 360 degree view. We've seen that move into the automotive space with parking cameras. So this really does transcend just what goes into vehicle manufacturing. It's a whole lot more than that. The more you look at it, the more you think about it, it really does make sense that car manufacturers want to get involved in understanding and studying robotics.